Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And if you're new here, my name is Edward Smith and welcome to my YouTube channel. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at some microphone boom arms ranging from $25 all the way up to $100. So if you're someone like me, that's a singer songwriter that's constantly recording vocals or doing YouTube tutorials and voiceovers, or a gamer that likes to stream a lot or someone that wants to set up a nice podcast, having a microphone boom arm is essential. And the reason it's so nice to have a microphone boom arm is because everything is so efficient and so easy to use. You don't have to go and set up a microphone every single time. You don't have to worry about running over the cable on the floor or getting stuck on the cable on the floor or anything like that. It's just so simple and easy to use. Use. and whenever you need your microphone you just pull it in front of your face and you're ready to go like right now and whenever you don't you just put it away and everything looks nice and neat so having a nice microphone boom arm is essential but picking the right boom arm for your specific setup is quite a challenge because I've been through quite a few boom arms over the last year year and a half from $25 all the way up to $100 and I've really figured out exactly what I need for my setup and where I maybe spent too much money on things that I didn't need and should have spent more money on things that that I did. So hopefully in today's video, I can help you find the best microphone boom arm for your specific setup. Starting off with the newer microphone boom arm, which retails for around 15 to 20 bucks. And this is a great boom arm for anyone in a budget studio setup or budget gaming setup, looking for a boom arm that's nice and small and obviously nice and cheap. But due to the fact that this boom arm is cheap, you're not really getting the best build quality. And I've had this boom arm for almost a year now and it's slowly but surely not being able to carry my heavier mics and the springs are starting to squeak every single time I move it. So the build quality is not great, but but it's still a very good product for 20 bucks. In terms of maximum extension, the newer microphone boom arm can extend all the way up to 76 centimeters, which is perfect for a small budget setup. And in terms of microphone weight that it can handle, it can handle up to 2.2 pounds, which is perfect because this Shure SM7B that I'm using as an example weighs around 1.6, 1.7 pounds. So it can handle this microphone quite nicely. But since I've had it for a year, it is starting to you know, struggle to hold it and bounce around. So it is one thing to keep in mind, but like I said, overall it is great. The length is great. The fact that it can hold a very heavy microphone is great and it only costs 20 bucks. The next microphone boom arm that we're gonna have a look at is made by Enogear and it retails for around 50 bucks and moving from the newer microphone boom arm to this boom arm is literally like moving from a cart to a car. It's such a big difference in terms of build quality, maximum extension, maximum weight that it can handle and just overall it's a much, much, much better product. When it comes to build quality, this product doesn't have any springs on the side like the newer did so you don't have any squeaking or anything like that happening in future and in terms of moving it around it's so nice and smooth it's so nice and solid and I can feel like my microphone is easily being held in the stand it's not falling over or anything like that it's very very solid when looking at the maximum extension of this boom arm, we're looking at a total of around 84 centimeters, which isn't much longer than the newer microphone boom arm, but it's definitely better, especially if your setup is slightly bigger. And when looking at the maximum weight capacity of this microphone boom arm, we're looking at around 3.5 pounds, which is considerably more than the previous newer microphone boom arm we looked at. And finally, moving on to the holy grail of microphone boom arms, the Rode PSA1, which retails for around $99 and is probably the most popular microphone boom arm in most professional settings. Whether you have a radio station or you're a professional podcaster, these are the microphone boom arms they use. And the reason they use it and the reason it costs $99 is because the overall build quality, the maximum extension, and the overall maximum weight that it can handle is the best of the best. And for Obviously looking at the build quality, it's a very solid product. The fact that I can extend it all the way out to almost 93 centimeters and it can still carry my Shure SM7B like it's not even carrying anything is crazy to me. It's so nice and smooth. Every single time I move it around, there's no kind of pushing or forcing it at all. It just moves automatically. And as soon as you let it go, your microphone just stays exactly where it needs to be. It doesn't bounce around or fall over at all. And like I said, the maximum extension is 93 centimeters, which is 
is perfect for my specific setup because I can't really put it on the side of my desk because it's really far but if I have to put it in front it's nice and perfect that when I have to record vocals or do something like that it just goes perfectly in front of my mouth and I don't have to worry about leaning to the side while playing or anything like that and also when looking at the maximum weight that this microphone boom arm can handle we're looking at around 4.4 pounds which is double that of the newer microphone boom arm and the fact that this microphone weighs 1.7 means that you can have two of these microphones on the stand and it will handle it with ease which is crazy so to end of this video if you're someone that's on a budget that really can't afford to pay 50 to 100 bucks for a microphone boom arm but you want that efficiency just being able to pull your microphone in front of you and be ready to go and have your setup nice and neat then the newer microphone boom arm is perfect for you but if you're someone that's looking for a product that won't break the bank at around 50 bucks that has better maximum extension maximum weight capacity and overall build quality then the Eno gear is perfect for you but for some of you that can afford to pay 100 bucks for a microphone boom arm, you cannot go wrong with a Rode PS1A. Like I said, you're getting a product that has the best maximum extension, the best weight capacity that a microphone boom arm can handle, the best overall build quality. It's used in most professional settings and it's definitely a product worth the price of $100. But other than that, if you guys enjoyed this microphone boom arm comparison, please do give this video a thumbs up and also do hit the subscribe button down below because I do have a goal of reaching 20,000 subscribers and I need all the help I can get. But other than that, thank you so much for watching and I will see you for another video next time.